Introducing first in the corner to my left, from Southwick, Massachusetts, Skyler! Her opponent in the corner to my right, from Toledo, Ohio, her milkshake brings all the boys to the yard. Please welcome Faye Jackson. Match is underway. DC being joined by Taylor Hendricks. Big match coming up later on tonight against Rachel Ellering. But uh, right now we've got somebody that's uh, a newcomer to professional wrestling in Skyler going up against Faye Jackson, making her WWR debut. And I, and I haven't seen too much of Faye Jackson, a last minute addition replacing uh, Solo Darling, who's out with an injury. Yes. What can we expect from this matchup? This matchup is very interesting, almost evenly matched, to be quite honest. We have Skylar here, who is coming. <laughs> it's very interesting. Both women have been wrestling between a year and a year and a half, and they both have something to prove in women's wrestling revolution. So Faye's brand new, too. She is. This will be her debut for WWR, and she's only been wrestling about a year and a half out of the Ring of Honor dojo. And we have Skylar here trying to make a name for herself with only her second match here at WWR, and she's coming to us from the Kevin Landry compound here in Massachusetts. Taylor Hendricks doing her homework! Yeah, I certainly do. And Skylar not wasting any time. The knees into the back, taking Faye Jackson down. Ooh, but that's not enough. With an opponent like Faye Jackson, you have to stay on her. She uses her size to her advantage. I almost wonder if it's the inexperience of Skylar that, uh, you know, she found herself in a position to perform that maneuver. But, I mean, you know, when you have a larger opponent landing on you like that, even if your knees are in the right spots, that's still going to be painful. And it's almost as if Faye Jackson pretty much just brushed off the attack and is just powering <laughs> through it. She is, and that's what she's known to do. And to be a, a different competitor and to stand out and have different skills, that's the type of things that you have to embrace within yourself. And with the little experience that she has, she's able, she's been able to do that very well. Have you shared the ring with either competitor? I have. I have shared the ring uh, at least once with Faye Jackson. And every match she has, she gets better and better. And look at the progress we have seen on Skylar here. She is giving us a hot scoop of sassy. Oh, and a schoolboy. Well, that's one way to do it. You got to use leverage against a larger opponent. Exactly. But that's where Skylar does not want to find herself. I mean, Faye Jackson very easily maneuvering her way around Skylar. Skylar definitely oh, telegraphed that. Yes, exactly. Can't blame Faye Jackson. She saw it come and got right out of the way. I'll look for a oh. northwest suplex, keeping the bridge. Oh, the ref didn't even seem to notice that her feet were actually under the ropes. Well, it's referee's in, discretion. It looks like his eyes were on the uh, the shoulders, as it were. Yeah. Hopefully, you get a better official sun for your match. Huh? <laughs> no, but what I'm getting at is uh, newer ladies. Uh, they they ha they're starting to learn ring awareness and a kick out. A lot of fans don't realize it takes a lot of energy to kick out, and having ring awareness like that actually makes it easier for you in the long run. The longer the match goes on. Oh, oh double, double knees from Skyler. But she could not get the leverage that she wanted on that pin. If she could have got Faye a little bit higher, stacked her up on her shoulders, it would have been more difficult. She needs Faye's to, weight would have been used against her. She needs to stay more focused on her opponent as opposed to the crowd at this point in time. Case in point, she is trying to whip into the turnbuckle. I mean, we saw it just a few minutes ago. Faye with one arm. Just getting Skylar into the buckle. Exactly. Uh-oh. Here we go. I think, uh, I think <laughs> Faye is, is looking to give Skylar a milkshake. Is that what you just said? Oh. I couldn't hear it, but judging by that, I would say so. Yeah. <laughs> oh! Yeah, that's a... Face wash. And, and looking to complete the trifecta, yeah, a malted milkshake, extra thick. She is on Dream Street. Faye Jackson doing just she does best. Oh! oh right to the face! Skylar away from the ropes, as you were talking about ring awareness, oh. where she was, uh, you know, unable with the Northern Light Suplex to keep Skylar away from the ropes. She did take an extra second or two and pulled Skylar, exactly. where Skylar would have to exert the extra energy to kick out. Oh, Skylar's back up, though. Skylar's tough, and Faye. She is. But when you're trained by Kevin, Lee, oh, that is the sky is falling down right there. That is a signature of Skylar right here. She's bringing it. Oh. oh. Just driving her One, face down to the mat. Two. Oh, Close last call. second, kick out, millisecond. Faye might have been knocked out. Again, Skylar has got to utilize maneuvers that, you know, are not requiring her to have to pick up her large opponent, try and maneuver her around. She's got to use, she's got to use Faye's size against her. Exactly. I was looking oh. for a leg drop, Faye rolled out of the way. Oh, oh my oh, God. Bonsai. 
Could Skyler's Jackson up trying to defend herself, but directly. drop it like it's hot. Is that what we're gonna see? Jesus! Oh, oh. that's it. That's it. Drop, drop it her. like it's drop hot. Drop her like you want to kill her. Good luck with your match oh. later on tonight, Taylor. Thank you.